Hey, what's going on guys? It's Royalic, and today I'm going to be showing you guys my top 5 favorite servers in Minecraft. So first we're going to start off with WoodyCraft, which is just WoodyCraft.net. Don't worry, um, all the IPs will be in the description, along with um, my server in case you want to join it. You know, you never know. But anyways, uh, let's get right into here. What WoodyCraft is, is basically it's like everything. It, let's wait my, for my chunks to load a little bit, actually. Um, looks like that's not going to happen. But anyway, he's got Survival, we got Skyblock. Um, this is the only um, server that I put that has Skyblock. Because I thought, you know, a lot of people like Skyblock, so here's one with Skyblock at least. Um, the one thing I like about the server a lot... Let me uh, make my way over there. Actually, I think I can use like a pressure pad that makes me like launch super far, super fast. Um, I think, no! Well, there it was, but that's not where I wanted to go. This way is what I wanted to do. Alright, over here. Huh! Oh my god, I hit the sign, I went so high. Whoa, what the f- Whoa! Well, it just launched me on top of here. But, uh, the, the he doesn't have many video, uh, mini games at the moment, but the ones he does have are really awesome. So, Sky Wars is like the best game ever. Well, no, it's, um, it's like Survival Island, but you guys, like, fight each other. It's really fun. And then Blocks vs. Zombies. This is, like, the first, uh, server I've ever seen that has Blocks vs. Zombies, and it's one of my favorite minigames by, uh, Seth Bling. So, definitely cool that he has that. And let's move on to the next server. So, in number four spot, it is... It is... The Hive. So, let's just join here. Now, this would be in, like, third or fourth place, something like that. I mean, third or second or something like that. But the problem is, is that um, I used to always play the survival games. But for some reason, when I play the survival games now, I, um, I lag out of them and I freeze out. And it just kicks me from the game. But I think their survival games is the best. It's just that I can't really play them anymore. I don't know why it does that. But their survival games is, like, amazing. I love how they have the chests all sorted out and everything. So that's basically why the server is getting its spot, just because of the amazing survival games. And then they also have an arcade, which is pretty cool, too. They have a couple um, unique minigames also, which let me just get over here. Let's join the arcade. And in the arcade, we have... Which way do we go? I don't even know. Not Splague. Well, Splake's pretty interesting, you know, you have a shovel and you shoot eggs at people, and then it's just like spleef, so it's pretty cool. But Hide and Seek, Hide and Seek is awesome. You know, you're as a block, you try to hide from people that try to figure out if you're a blocker or a human, and it's really fun and stuff. So, let's move on to the number third spot now. Number, number third, number three spot, and I don't know, whatever. Which, number three is Hypixel Server, which we'll join in right here. Now, Hypixel Server is actually the survival games that I have been playing on now, which his is definitely the second best survival games. Um, the only thing is, is that he doesn't have a lot of maps, and they all kind of look the same in a way. So that's one downside to it a lot. And then he has a couple really fun games like Quakecraft. Quakecraft is really cool. Like, you know, you have a hoe and you right-click and shoot people with it. Really fun. And um, some other fun mini games, Vampire Z... And then he has a lot of TNT games, which a lot of them are really fun too. All the mini games he has are really fun. Like uh, Bow Spleef, you shoot you shoot flaming arrows at TNT to shoot people out. And then like, um, do not have any boosters. I don't know what that is, but whatever. And like TNT run, you know, he has a lot. Like the mini, the things he does have are really fun. I enjoy all of the games he has. So that's what deserved him of the number three spot. And now number two is Mineplex, which I actually just figured out this server, maybe, whoa, god, that is loud, oh my gosh, but, um, number three spot, I mean, number, number two, jeez, is, um, Mineplex, which, like I said, I only figured about it, figured out about it, like, a month ago, but it's really, really awesome, like, all the minigames, I've never seen, like, almost any of the minigames, they're all really, really unique and fun, like, um, the arcade, let's go to, like, the arcade has Dragon Escape Squid Shooter, um, let's look at some other ones, Bacon Brawl, Super Spleef, like, Turf Brawl, like, all of them, I'm guessing you guys probably don't even know what they are, but all of them are really fun, 
and I enjoyed a lot. So let's move on to number one, which number one is the Shopo Network, which I agree this is a little, I'm a little biased to the server, unfortunately, because I've been playing the server for over a year now, and it has the best game ever invented, Mind Z. It's flippin' fantastic. And they actually just added Mind Z with guns. And they have like a Super Craft Bro kind of thing just called Smash. And they have like a Bomberman game. And then they have Annihilation, which is like, whoa. <laughs> I'm lagging. I was just flying in the air. But then they have this game called Annihilation, which basically each team has a Nexus. And the other teams have to try to destroy their Nexuses while defending your own. Just me explaining it actually makes me want to play a game of it right now. Like, all- oh my god. This is like the best server ever. If you don't know this server, you better freaking play it. Whoa! Well, <laughs> that's okay. Because it's the end of the video. Kind of. So, like the video if you enjoyed, and if you found on any of these servers pretty cool that you'd maybe like to play. And if you're new, don't forget to click that subscribe button. And until next time, see you guys later.